Hey everyone, in this video, I am going to be talking about how you can fix this error code into your Windows 10 or 11. Okay, this error message usually pops up when you run try to run an application or a game on your computer. Okay, and it can be quite frustrating, but do not worry, there's not lots of solutions I have listed up in this blog which you can try. I'm going to give you the top three solutions that works, so you can try that. If that doesn't work, you can come up to this blog and then do that okay so the first thing that you, that i am going to tell you to do is that run the program as an administrator because what happens is that most often you get this error because you are not running the program as an administrator now if that doesn't if that is not working for you i'm i would recommend you to install directx okay so directx basically gives you all those packages that you that your program need okay so I, I would recommend you to first go to, to to update directx or to download it just go to here click on directx it will take you to this page click on download and it will download it and i've already downloaded it and it will be something like this dxwebsetup.exe open the file and then run it and and after the, the this ds.exe install it properly and then restart your laptop okay so to and then restart your laptop to restart your laptop you can basically go to here i have listed this in an easy way to restart your laptop what you can do is basically run this command windows plus r and then just type this command and click enter like this windows r cmd okay and then write this command and hit enter it will automatically restart the computer for you okay these two things is really helpful if that doesn't work i would recommend you to repair your microsoft c++ redistributors okay so what basically is this is that first you copy this command and click windows r it will open this dialog click okay okay and it will take you to your applications just search for c++ and all these icons you see you click on right click on and click on change and then click on repair and it will automatically repair for you and after after repairing all of them just restart your computer and then run the application again it should work if these three things does not work for you i would recommend you to read this article there are other solutions as well which works so try this out and let me know okay i'll leave the, the link in the description thank you for watching